Last May, News 9 Investigates reported on a statewide shortage of psychiatrists who evaluate the dangerousness of suspects charged with crimes. Since then, one county attorney says the process has improved significantly. It wasn't widely known that there was this problem, and so once it became more widely known that there was a problem like this, uh, we were able to come up with a solution. The issue came to light after an alleged sexual assault in Manchester. A Murray Deal was in jail on an unrelated case Case, but News 9 investigates discovered that because prosecutors could not get the required psychiatric evaluation within a 90 day window, Deal was released. Two days later, Manchester police say he attacked a woman at a cemetery. A hearing was scheduled in his case for today, but was canceled. Belknap County Attorney Andrew Livernoise says since that case came to light, the Attorney General's office worked with all 10 county attorneys to come up with a list of psychiatrists and nurse practitioners who can do the competency evaluations. I had a case uh, just this month of a defendant who was found not competent and not restorable and dangerous. And uh, I reached out to the Attorney General's office. We were able to line up a psychiatrist to do the evaluation. Uh, that was done in a, in a timely fashion. In a statement, Attorney General John Formella says we will not be complacent and will continue to work hard to build on the progress we have made. So, so it's working. It's actually working quite well now. The Belknap County attorney says they are still looking at the system as a whole to see if there are legislative fixes that still need to be made. But that's a long-term goal, and in the short term, these improvements are working. Reporting live, Mike Cronin, WMUR News 9.